Howdy, my name is George Herhan. Today we will talk about how to properly blow a whistle. There's a common mis misconception that all you really do is blow into the whistle and it'll produce noise. That is true, but if you want to set yourself apart and be a professional whistle blower, so when people hear and be like, wow, he knows how to blow a whistle, there's a certain technique that you want to incorporate into your whistle blowing. Commonly, people take the whistle and blow into it. The noise will come out, it'll be effective, but it sounds weak and kind of floating around. And that's not what you want when you blow a whistle. What you want is to gather people's attention quickly, and to do that, you will do the sunflower technique. When you eat sunflower seeds and you want to spit out the shells, you use your tongue yeah, to, to spit the seed out. And that's what you're gonna do when you uh, use a whistle. You'll use your tongue to put it in the hole of the whistle, and you will start to blow. And when you begin to blow, you pull your tongue out, It'll produce a sharper, more abrupt sound. And to end the whistle blowing, you put your tongue back into the hole. All right. And I'm gonna demonstrate that for you here. And as you can see, you get a much sharper sounding whistle. It, it provides confidence to your whistle blowing. So when we, people hear it, they're like, wow, he wants our attention and he wants it now. All right, so just to demonstrate again, sunflower technique, like spitting out sunflower seeds with the whistle. And if you want to do multiple whistle blows, you just keep putting your tongue in and out of the hole. And that's how you will properly blow a whistle.